tell me a little bit about yourself and how you came to the Windsor Court. Well, I've been the harpist with the Louisiana Philharmonic back, actually, originally it was the New Orleans Symphony, but now we're the Louisiana Philharmonic for the past 32 years. And when we had the World's Fair here in New Orleans, that's when the Windsor Court opened. And several months after it opened, Mr. Coleman, who was the owner of the hotel at the time, approached me about coming to play for the tea several days a week. And, and tell me about that. What's it like to play for an audience during tea at La Salon? You know, it's a very interesting experience. Some of the um, guests are very sophisticated and they know not only classical music, but they even make specific requests of things from the harp repertoire. And other people would like me to play love songs or Irish music or um, children's songs. Um, so it's a very varied audience and that's I think what, one of the things that keeps it most interesting. And has it provided any unique experiences for you during the years? Well, I've certainly met lots of famous people that have come through. Um, one of my favorite stories is uh, when John Bon Jovi came in the first time, and I actually wasn't completely sure who he was, but I could see everybody fainting and falling out all over the lobby. <laughs> and uh, we talked for a good while and um, discovered that we had both gone to Juilliard, although at different times. And he actually gave me tickets that night to his concert, and I still didn't know who he was. Till <laughs> but, but um, and then on subsequent visits, we had a nice chance to visit, so it's been great. A lot of lovely people come through, and we have a tremendous number of repeat guests, and so it's kind of fun to get to know what they like and try to accommodate their taste in music as well. Very nice. So what does it mean to you to play at a hotel like the Windsor Court? Well, you know, I've had the great fortune in my career of traveling not just throughout the United States but around the world. And the minute you say you're from New Orleans they, and the topic of a hotel comes up, everyone seems to know the Windsor Court Hotel and everyone raves about it. And I have to say it's quite a thrill to have played tea in a hotel for so many years. I've been at the hotel for over 23 years now. And that's quite extraordinary in the music business, let alone the hotel business. So I certainly appreciate my long-standing relationship with all the different people who have been involved with the project over the years. Thank you very much. My pleasure.